is about 4.5 billion years old and 150 million kilometers away from the Earth. The light from the sun is what keeps our planet warm and worth living. The sun is a star, and when a star explodes, it is called a supernova. It is powered by nuclear fusion, and it turns hydrogen into helium in a process that converts mass into energy. That is in the form of light reaching in 8 minutes and 20 seconds to Earth. But what would happen if the sun exploded tomorrow? What would happen to the solar system? What would reach first, energy, heat or impact of explosion? How many planets would get the impact? You are watching Deep Bright Zone and here's what would happen if the sun exploded tomorrow. Once the supply of hydrogen is gone, it will cease the internal thermonuclear reactions that enable the sun to shine. It will start growing dramatically into a red giant, puffing away its outer layers that will engulf Mercury and Venus and likely reach the Earth. But Mars, Jupiter, Saturn, Uranus and Neptune will survive and continue to go around the dying sun. Einstein's theory says that the force of explosion would reach Earth before the heat and energy would reach us. But we would not be able to hear anything, because sound waves cannot travel in space. Most of the energy from such an explosion would be traveling at the speed of light or nearly as fast. So life on Earth would end pretty much as soon as the first sign of the explosion arrived. The life on our planet would be completely wiped, quite instantaneously. For about a billion years, the sun will burn as a red giant. Then the hydrogen in that outer core will deplete, leaving an abundance of helium. Once all the helium disappears, the force of gravity will take over. All the planets except Mercury, Venus and Earth would go spinning out of control into further outer space. And the sun will get smaller and smaller eventually becoming what we then call a white dwarf and slowly cool down to the background temperature of the universe. A white dwarf is the core of a dead star and only a little larger than Earth. But they are extremely heavy, weighing almost as much as the sun while being only the size of the Earth. A teaspoon of white dwarf would weigh somewhere around 6,000 kilograms. But white dwarf is small, it does not produce as much light, a white dwarf does not have any fuel to give it energy. So it will also get colder and colder over time, eventually it will become very dark. So what do you think about this? If you have any question or suggestions, comment down below the video. Thanks for watching, subscribe to this channel if you haven't already and also press the bell icon to get the notifications of new episodes.